you guys think that you, these look better than your first ones? I think they look so The same? I think they look better than your first ones. You're learning how to work with the clay. We're at Pueblo Grande Museum and we are at the Hohokam Experience Summer Camp. The museum is an archaeological park that has the prehistoric ruins of the Hohokam people who lived in the valley from about 81 to 1450. Now remember, you want your pancake to be even. We want to bring in the Native American culture. We have a four-week program and it's for 7 to 12 year olds and they come in and each week is something different and this year we're offering um, a clay pottery class and we're also offering jewelry of ancient cultures and a week in the life of a Hohokam so we're doing a bunch of different activities that they'll be able to come in and not only learn but have fun. Well you don't want to flatten it out you can just squeeze it. We are in the first week which is playing with clay the New Mexican way and it's all about New Mexican pottery and how pottery is made right from the beginning from the clay all the way to the design and how it is fired in the traditional way. Clay is drying and you need to put your next coil on top before it dries. Um, when we're doing the coil technique, you pretty much roll it into a snake and then just wrap it around the flat pancake. Well, it's important in that, you know, they see that there's it's more than just for art or for fun, but it was also used for many utilitarian purposes, food, water, also ceremonies as well. So not only learning about how it's formed, but also the designs also have a lot to do with that. You don't want too much water, because if you put too much water, melt. it will melt, yes. Well, it's a lot of fun, because you get to design your own pots and kind of do your own thing. I love my job. It's great because you get to educate people and they have a great time and it's a, it's a social thing. It's an academic thing and they get to come out and have a lot of fun. We try to bring people in to appreciate the cultures that came before and how we've been able to build on the cultures that came before us.